In this lesson, we will see what happens to the volume and mass when we are combining two liquids into a solution. Put exactly 50 milliliters of water into one of the graduated cylinders. You can use a pipette to help you get an exact amount. Measure the mass of the cylinder and its contents. Record your results in Table 1. Now put exactly 50 milliliters of ethyl alcohol into the other graduated cylinder. Measure the mass of the cylinder and its contents. Record your results in Table 1. Use the information you recorded to make a prediction of what you think the mass and volume will be when you combine the substances. Carefully pour the ethyl alcohol into the graduated cylinder with the water. Allow a minute for the ethyl alcohol to drain completely from the graduated cylinder and be careful to avoid spilling any substance. Read the graduated cylinder at eye level to see what the volume is for the mixture. Put the ethyl alcohol and water mixture as well as the empty cylinder on the balance to find the total mass. You should notice that your volume is anywhere from 2 to 5 milliliters lower than your prediction and that your mass should have stayed exactly the same. This shows that when the molecules are dissolved, they are reorganized, and this causes the volume to decrease. It also shows that the mass stayed exactly the same. This helps to prove the law of conservation of mass. Even though the substances are mixed, we find that the number of molecules are exactly the same. The mass doesn't change.